Do you ask yourself what style you should pursue? Today I want to talk about how style relates to the unity and variety of lines. What is unity and variety of lines? Unity describes how all the shapes fit into the whole. It is how we organize the complex information and simplify them to fit our purposes. Using unity harmonizes the whole painting. The unity of lines describes the underlying lines of any painting which flow through the painting and forms. Now, variety of lines are all lines that are not perfect. As the name suggests, they have a lot of variety, as opposed to circles and squares, which are only used as underlying armatures to create unity and artistic purposes. Now what you can see here is a scale where you can chart where the paintings belong on a scale from variety to unity. And all paintings can be charted somewhere on there if you look at them abstractly. Where would your paintings belong in there? This is kind of your style, right? So when you want to change your style, ask yourself the following question. Do I want my painting to have more variety or more unity? If we look at these paintings, they all work somehow, right? In the end, it depends on our own taste, on what we want. Maybe we want all the intricacies and details, like here. Or maybe we just like simple graphic compositions. Like this hopper painting is really graphic and simple, right? And obviously, Russian painters have a lot of variety in their paintings. I can just draw in the shapes of the lines and you can see they have so much variety in their shapes and in their lines. It never really gets boring when you look at Russian paintings. And here we can see that the shape, the line in itself, has a lot of variety in their curves as opposed to some of the simpler compositions. Like here the lines are really simplified in graphic shapes. You can really see these square shapes, these round shapes here. And it is always something in between. Maybe a painting has a lot of unity, but it also has some of the variety that you can get out of painting from life. But here you can see that they are still simplified to an extent. And for example, Line Decker is very good at simplifying and at unity. His shapes are very graphic and he simplifies everything to the essentials. And we have this here as well. We have some simplification, but the variety is really what's, what's showing through. I'm just blending in the names of the artists now so that you know who they are. And of course, a balance of both variety and unity is what we strive for in the end. But all in all, we can say that unity should be considered first and variety should support the structure. Otherwise, we have lack of purpose and lack of design in our paintings, which is key to all artistic endeavors. So I hope you got something out of this video. And if you like my videos, please share, like and subscribe to my channel. Videos are released every Wednesday. See you soon.